गुड मॉर्निंग पायरेट्स वेलकम टू आर चैनल बैंक निफ्टी जोन्स तो बैंक निफ्टी जोन्स में हम एनालाइज करते हैं बैंक निफ्टी को बाय ओनली टू लाइंस विदाउट यूजिंग एनी टेक्निकल एंड फंडामेंटल दैट मींस वी आर नॉट यूजिंग एनी कैंडल सिक वी आर नॉट डिस्कसिंग इन कैंडल सिक चार्ट पैटर्न इंडिकेटर्स और ऑप्शन है nothing from this only using two horizontal flat lines we can analyze the market the more stronger than any other tool which is currently present in the market you can also check our past analysis what we have projected and what is going what has happened on the next day it is like we have projected on november 21 the market is going to give us 500 points move and on 26 you can see the 500 points move got completed so like this we are going to analyze nifty and bank nifty every day and with your support i can definitely create such videos for retail traders so you now your task is to subscribe this channel get uh, click on the notification icon also share this to your uh, retail participants also share this with uh, the uh, traders or investors those you are aware of share this in any whatsapp group you would like to share so that every retail participant can at least test this theory and he can save uh, his hard his or her hard earned money uh, before losing into the market so today now uh, so now we are going to analyze nifty and bank nifty as said today is 30th november 2022 and we are going to analyze nifty so in nifty as we have checked what has happened with nifty is nifty is uh entered nifty has entered into the third primary so first primary done second primary done and we have entered into the third primary so the major concern is whether the nifty will create new all time high it has already created will it sustain yes definitely it is going to sustain and we are going to go up by up to 19000 200 19186 that is what is the current view so it is like from any low if nifty is crossing above this level primary range it can climb it has a power to climb to 2x that is what is going to happen will happen with nifty and if nifty is going to it is like if if, if nifty is going to rise it will rise up to 3x and in this case you can see instead of going to 3x nifty has taken some fall why that fall how we can identify nifty is going to fall instead of going up it is going to come down the same way we are going to analyze this today so you'll also get the answer for that move which has happened in the past okay so we are in primary and as per primary move nifty is showing from this point onwards from this point onwards nifty has shown it has a capacity to to travel to next 2x and that is what has happened in the price and the, that means the the primary move should take nifty upside but there is an secondary move what is the role of secondary move so nifty whenever you are going up nifty has a capacity to come down by 267 points from any high 267 points from any high but not below 267 points so you can see from any high it is coming down by 267 points from any high it is coming down by 267 points and now we need to see whether it has again a capacity to come down by 267 points or not so for that we need to check the 15 minutes time frame this is 15 minutes time frame and in 15 minutes time frame it is still bullish okay but as it is bullish so the primary range is bullish secondary range that means when the price will complete this or without completing this price has to reach to this point so we will also check minor range because secondary is saying whether secondary uh, power can bring price to this level or not the answer is lying inside 5 minutes time frame so in in 5 minutes time frame we first want to know whether the minor trend is broken or not how to identify that nifty should break below 61 points so if nifty is below 61 points okay yes the answer is yes so nifty has a capacity to go to at least 120 points okay it is not the complete capacity like 267 points but first it will reach to 120 points and then if it is going below 125 points uh, then it has a capacity to reach to 267 points that is what and the strength is still bullish but we are on the level of crossing the power like if the power is going below like rsi is going below 49 the nifty has 
capacity to fall by minor range fall by minor range because we are in 5 minutes time frame so what overall analysis is saying what overall analysis is saying nifty has a capacity to trend minor downside and if the line is crossed then it has capacity to travel to 267 points but still our targets are on upside and this is also allowed in this trend what about bank nifty so bank nifty if we are going if we are checking bank nifty as we mentioned bank nifty has crossed this range and it has to travel to 2x that is what has happened with bank nifty even at this point we said bank nifty could enter into third x and now it has already entered into third x and we are approaching to 43 something it is like 44,000 approximately and what does that means bank nifty has capacity to go up at the same time bank nifty has a capacity to fall down by at least 750 points so here you can see 750 points fall again from recent high it has taken an additional low below 750 point near 750 points from this high this is 750 from this high this is 750 from this side this is below 750 near to 750 so in this case what we should expect is bank nifty can have capacity to fall to 40 to 600 and the upside limit is 43 900 so in this case we need to check secondary zone range secondary zone range is saying we are still bullish and then we need to check what is happening with the minor is the minor has already crossed the limits so we will go and ask to five minutes time frame five minutes time frame is saying okay we have already crossed one something uh, 142 points that means we have broken the minor uptrend and the price has a capacity to come down to 292 points from this high from recent high price has a capacity to come down so there is short distance remaining if price is crossing below this then we should think about this range secondary zone range this can be starting from this point or this point but at least 750 points fall if the price is close crossing and closing already you can see the power is below 49 but it should sustain below 14 and here in this case it did not sustain in the first candle itself the price push upside even at this point price pushed upside in this case if it is pushed upside then we are ready to go to upside and still upside targets are pending but if it is crossing below then we are ready to go to downside that is what the expectation about bank nifty and we have also listed out some of the stocks you can check the stocks ratna money that's uh, that's these are the stocks where FIs are investing their money not from today they are investing their money since last few quarters that means their target is still pending and you can also get the opportunity and you can grab the opportunity you can invest your money so this is at the good uh, point it is like price is kissing ESA uh, EMA so price is very close to EMA so that's the best stop loss point you can invest your money at the risk of 12% from EMA just first understand the concept of opportunity, opportunity window, how the risk is calculated, what quantity you should deploy, and then go for these stocks. There is again the tree veni turbine. This was also the stock which is there in our list since last few days, and it has already uh, uh, satisfied the criteria that it is near EMA. You can also invest in this for next 12%. If you are checking next, Vainati stock, Vinati Organics, okay, it is already, the opportunity is already consumed some part of the opportunity, like this was the best opportunity, like what we are discussing here, it, that has happened in past, the past of this stock was this, or this stock was this, and after that price is going up, uh, going up, we should, we can also buy over here, but we should wait for the best opportunity, you can add some quantities by calculating the total risk, this from this point to this point plus 12 percent so total is so you will get less quantity over here you can revise your quantity here likewise sun pharma was there in the list angel one was in the list sci was in the list the gray geship geship was we are discussing geship since last few days and you can see how this opportunity has converted into good return so you could have bought geship at this this point and still you could have carried this at least like 520 to 720 it is 200 points and in terms of percentage it is really good percentage of return 
it is like approximately 30% return you could have on in cash kind of stock okay so pirates so i am done with the analysis i would like to continue this analysis i need your support you if you're watching this video kindly comment kindly subscribe and kindly share this youtube channel to your fellow colleagues to your uh, uh, friends to your uh, near and dear ones so that with this channel will get some uh presence on internet and this will this channel should reach to all the retailers that is what the purpose is i am currently doing good with my theory and i would like to share this theory with all the retail participants thank you so much so let us close this session and let's meet on our next session then let's see how the market is reacting to our levels thank you